Here we have a 2016 Mercedes-Benz C220D AMG line. Now with this vehicle, you've got the 20 inch alloy wheels, all in excellent condition, as you can see just there, and how fantastic do they look. We've got the Iridium Silver metallic exterior paintwork on this car as well, complementing the black features around the vehicle. We've got the Panamerica style front grille with the blacked out Mercedes badging at the front end there, front splitter down below. You'll also see We've got the black side skirts at the side of the vehicle as well. There's a closer look at your second alloy wheel. Again, excellent condition. You've got a color coded wing mirrors and door handles, black trim around the windows with the privacy glass for the rear passengers. Coming to the rear, there's a closer look at your third 20 inch alloy wheel. Now, taking a step back, we do have front and rear parking sensors on this vehicle as well as a reversing camera. You've also got the black tip exhausts. And there's a look at the rear view of this car. Really great looking vehicle this. Now I'll come around to this corner, you'll see that the vehicle itself is free from any major marks, dents or scratches. And there's a closer look at your last alloy wheel. Going on to the interior next, we'll start at the rear first. You'll notice we've got a full leather interior with the contrasting stitching. Two seats in the back with the cup holders in the center. ISO fixed points within the seats. On the side, you've got your integrated speakers. Now in the front here, we've got that same full leather interior. Again, with the contrasting stitching. Both front seats are heated as well, which can be controlled on the doors just here on both sides. You've then got your integrated speakers, power folding wing mirrors with electric window controls, unlock and lock button. You've also got a bit release down there as well. Auto light controls on your right hand side. Stepping inside the vehicle, we'll turn the car on, foot on the brake and turn the key. I've not put the seat in properly there, that's what that warning is, it's nothing to worry about at all. You've then got your multifunctional steering wheel with different controls while it's trying to go. Paddle shifters just behind for taking manual control of your gears. On the left you'll find your speed limiter and cruise control stalk as well. Coming into the centre you've got your infotainment screen with features like satellite navigation. DAB and FM radio. You've got different forms of media connectivity as well, like Bluetooth, disc, memory card, and USB. You've also got phone connectivity in here for making calls or listening to your music. Different dynamic driving modes can be found as well, consisting of individual, sport plus, sport, comfort, and eco, so you can pick and choose which mode best suits your driving style at a time. Put the car into reverse and you'll see your reversing camera on the display there with two separate views like so as well. Now working our way down, you've then got the vents as well as your dual zone climate control so you can control each side of the vehicle's temperature independently. You can also access your climate controls menu like so as well. Coming down, you've then got some more shortcuts with the Mercedes clock in the center. Below here, you've got two good sized cup holders, additional storage and 12 volt connectivity. More shortcuts in the center consisting of your dynamic driving modes, button to turn off your parking sensors, start stop technology, volume wheel and of course a power button for the infotainment screen. You've also got your soft touch leather armrest with additional storage space to the side as well as two USBs and an SD card slot. Now the vehicle is ready to drive away today with free next day nationwide delivery, competitive low finance, fresh service, fresh MOT and it's also HPI clear. That is all from me on today's video, thank you for watching.